What's going on you guys? This is Aaron from the Park Series Capital and welcome to the video. In this video we're introducing an exciting new company to the channel and that company is called Eurosun Mining. Now Eurosun Mining has 100% ownership of one of Europe's largest gold and copper projects which we will be talking about a little bit more in depth in this video. We will also be interviewing their CEO and bringing you guys many more videos as we initiate coverage on this company so I'm excited to be talking about this. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments down below what you think about the company. Also, don't forget to leave us a like. It does mean the world to me. It helps my videos so, so very much along with hitting that subscribe button and the bell for notifications on future videos. So guys, let's get straight into this video. And last but not least, for full disclosure details, this is a sponsored video. So check the description down below for full disclosure details along with thoroughly reading our disclaimer and always remembering that these videos are not financial advice. So guys, I bring you Euro Sun Mining. So Eurosun Mining is traded on the Toronto Stock Exchange under ticker symbol ESM. Let's first go over the stock real quick. It's got a 52-week range of 29.5 cents all the way up to 48 cents. So it's traded in a fairly tight range over the last year. As we can see here, um, it looks to have bottomed around 29.30 cents and it has been on the uptick. Gold markets, it's been a little bit shaky, but uh, this could be a great time to take a look at Eurosun Mining. So let's go over you know, the key highlights. And we're going to focus on the Ravina Valley project. It's one of Europe's largest gold and copper projects. So let's go over the asset first. This is, you know, the most important thing when it comes to this company is their flagship asset. And you can find all this information at eurosunmining.com. So Eurosun's flagship project, the Ravina Valley project, is one of the largest undeveloped copper gold assets in the world. 10.1 million ounces of gold equivalent. You know, that's a, a lot of gold. RVP's Porphyr system allows ESM to construct a simple and large-scale operation. So they are located in Romania. The low-impact mining plan includes using dry stacking, existing infrastructure, renewable grid electricity, a closed water management circuit, and zero cyanide. Let's dive a little bit further into that asset. So Eurosun Mining is developing the Porphyr Rovina Valley project, which is one of the top two largest undeveloped projects in Europe. The Rovina Valley project is located in western central Romania, and consists of three separate deposits, Klonik, Rovina, and Cristata. ESM's primary focus is on developing the Rovina and Klonik deposits, which are to be operated through predictable and simple open pit mining techniques. Cristata offers significant additional upside and will be assessed during the 17-year operation of Rovina and Klonik. So just taking a quick look at the metrics, DFS 2021 base case, and that's gold at fifteen fifty and copper at three dollars and thirty cents per pound. So the pre-tax NPV four hundred forty-seven million, IRR of nineteen point two percent, and free cash flow of seven hundred thirteen million U.S. dollars. So you can find all the information here when it comes to the grading, the size of the deposit. Um, we're going to quickly go over a few more things when it comes to their website, and then we're going to dive into the investor presentation for this introductory video. So RVP highlights. Strategic critical metal asset within the European Union containing 7 million ounces of gold and 1.4 million pounds of copper measured and indicated. Rovina Valley will be a sustainable and scalable operation for 17 years with strong cash flows. Average annual production of 106,000 ounces of gold and 9,000 tons of copper at an all-in sustained cost of $813 per ounce of gold, which is pretty good. Low impact sustainable mining with zero cyanide processing dry stack tailings, and concurrent reclamation. Significant local growth opportunity, both with the RVP complex and across Romania. Strong social license to operate with full support of local communities and regional and national governments. Committed to operating in line with the international ESG standards and focused on leaving a lasting and positive legacy. And this is what we just talked about. So RVP is strongly leveraged to metal prices with an NPV of US 447 million and an IRR of 19.2% at a base case of 15.50 gold, that's US dollars, and $3.30 per pound copper, which I think is pretty conservative. Um, I, you know, I'm a gold bull, so obviously I'm looking for gold to surpass 2,000 in the next three to five years, hopefully, fingers crossed. But uh, let's get into their investor presentation now. So you can find the investor presentation right there on their website. We're going to simply click on this video and go over the key points. I'm not going to get super technical as we will leave that for our interview with their CEO. Responsible development of strategic metals within the European Union. And this is most recent as of August 2021. 
So, Euro Sun Mining, unlocking value through the responsible development of one of the largest gold copper projects in the European Union. Leadership, executive team and board with extensive global mining experience developing and operating large assets. Strategic asset to reiterate, Euro Sun's 100% owned Ravina Valley project in Romania represents one of Europe's largest gold and copper projects. Romania provides a long-standing mining jurisdiction, strategically located amongst European Union-owned and operated smelters. 7 million ounces of gold and 233,000 tons of copper measured and indicated resource already defined. So that is a massive asset. ESG commitment. Clear environmental, social, and governance commitments that are aligned with internationally recognized standards and goals. Investment opportunity. Access to Europe's next gold copper producer. So that is exciting that they are targeting production and the size of the asset. I mean, it totally makes sense. So a proven track record of leadership. So the right combination of global expertise and governance. Scott Moore, which we will be interviewing, president, CEO, and director. Global mining expertise, Freeport McMoran, Anglo-American, London Mining, Gold Corp, Glencore, and Extrata. Track record. So Red Lake, Canada, Jacobina, Brazil, Los Broncos, Chile, many other companies. Supplying critical metals within the European Union, so leading the sector towards a more sustainable and responsible path of providing critical metals to the European Union. Europe consumes 16% of the global copper market in 2018, but only accounts for 5% of global production. Copper demand is expected to reach 3.5 million tons by 2030, driven by EV growth, increasing urbanization and industrialization. As South American production becomes more unstable, and the Western world looks to source responsible alternatives outside of China and the DRC, Euro Sun will provide a sustainable supply to feed the growing decarbonization push. So, regards to copper, Euro Sun will produce a clean high grade copper concentrate with a strong gold credit at an AISC of $1.70 per pound. There's a strong demand at European smelters for clean concentrate with Spain, Germany, Serbia, and Sweden all being strategic markets for the concentrate. Cyanide free processing reduces the need for chemicals within the process, significantly mitigating impurity penalties. The European Union is taking steps to cut reliance on China for raw materials. Ravina Valley project will be a sustainable and scalable operation for 17 years with strong cash flows within the European Union. So guys, let's take a quick look at Romania to educate our viewers. So a stable democracy in the European Union, long-standing mining jurisdiction, which values economic development from mining activities, excellent established infrastructure, Mining code provides general principles of transparency and free competition, strategically located amongst key EU-owned smelters, rule of law, transparent financial system. So Ravina Valley Gold and Copper Project, we're going to reiterate a few highlights. So when it comes to the highlights, 10.1 million ounces, but measured and indicated 7 million ounces of gold, and 233,000 tons of copper, measured and indicated year one to 1046,000 ounces of gold production and uh, 106,000 ounces of gold and 9,000 tons of copper over the entire 17 year mine life. First production in 2024, 17 year mine life in phase one, low impact mining located near local infrastructure. And another thing to note is uh, open pit and straightforward porphyry geology allows for predictable and simple mining. So this is not underground mining, this is open pit. Length of mine AISC, $813 an ounce gold. $713 million free cash flow, significant leverage to metal prices. With a low AISC like that, um, yes, definitely significant leverage to uh, metal prices. Clear ESG commitments aligned to the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals, low impact mining, minimizing our environmental impact through responsible mining practices. So the investment opportunity. I would say the main things to highlight here would be the AISC, of course, $813. First production is we're still a couple years out. Zero cyanide, which is important, 17 year mine life. Um, and the second largest undeveloped asset in Europe. So right now at $813 AISC, you know, there's still a lot of money to be made, even at current prices, which are almost 1800 US dollars per ounce. But um, a lot of industry experts are saying that, uh, you know, we could be heading into a metals bull market for the next three to five years, fingers crossed. So hopefully that's the case. So key value catalyst, clear path to unlocking value. Now let's talk about the next steps. Next steps, unlocking value towards construction. So London stock exchange listing, rezoning plan approved, receipt of environmental impact assessment, off take agreement secured in issuance of construction license and project financing finalized. 
So guys, that's it for the introductory video. And once again, the key points I want to make is Eurosun Mining has a really interesting, very large deposit. So it's going to be exciting to see their project progress. I'm excited to interview their CEO. This is just the introductory video. So let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about the company. Let me know what you think about the gold market in general. I always love to hear from you guys. All comments welcome. And uh, that's it for the video. Thanks so much, guys. And we'll see you in our next video. If you like these videos, kindly hit that subscribe button and the bell for notifications. Drop us a comment down below. We'd love to hear from you. And finally, always remember, Departures Capital is for information, education, and entertainment purposes only. Don't buy or sell a stock because you heard it on here. Buy or sell a stock because you've done your research, you've done your thorough due diligence, and you're making your own personal investment decisions for yourself. This video is not financial advice. Furthermore, this video may or may not have been sponsored by the companies that we've profiled within this video, and we may or may not own shares of any of the profiled companies in this video. If you want to know the full disclosure details, check the description down below along with thoroughly reading our disclaimer. Thanks so much for watching guys and I look forward to seeing you in our next video.